In this video, I have a major update for AMC stocks, specifically regarding the massive reverse repo numbers and what this means for the AMC short squeeze. Before I get into this video, show your support for AMC by smashing that like button. It only takes a few seconds and I really would appreciate it. Also, be sure to hit that subscribe button if you're new so you don't miss out on future videos. Keep in mind, this is not financial advice. Now let's get right into it. So it was just reported that the reverse repo is said to be $1.45 trillion and this is the $73 trillion reverse repo in a row now let me explain what this means because you are going to be very shocked so big banks have a lot of cash on hand to a bank cash is not an asset like it is to us think of a store that has inventory on the shelf yes they own the inventory but until it's sold or for a bank the cash is lent out it's not profitable and can bring on added maintenance cost profit isn't made until it leaves their front door in a customer's hands so they buy u.s treasuries from the fed reserve as treasury securities go up up, whereas cash can actually go down i suspect that much of this sudden influx of cash sitting at commercial banks is the result of added hedgy collateral put up to support their leverage which in turn is used to prop up their margin needs reverse repos were after all basically zero for a very long time up until march and since then have reached all-time highs so what does this have to do with amc i think reverse repo trends being that they seem to be fairly consistent to the stock price reflect that hedgy has had to put up this trillion dollar plus to keep their shorts alive speculation on citadel's 13 f's and own statements lead to the math that they are leveraged up to 10 to 1 on their positions so approximately 15 trillion dollars worth of shorts that didn't exist prior to march now do across the meme stocks the other thing to note about banks selling their cash to the fed overnight instead of investing it is that the banks were basically signaling that they don't see worthwhile investment in the market right now like a bubble they expect to pop soon most major banks and investment firms have already signaled a market correction inbound this would seem to support that theory guys just to sum it up the banks are essentially preparing for something massive and i think that is going to be the short squeeze also guys if you haven't done so already join our discord group we are having so much fun and have made a ton of money so far the link to join is down in the description now guys do me a favor and drop a comment and let me know are you celebrating thanksgiving with that said if you enjoyed this quick update be sure to smash that like button i really would appreciate it and also be sure to subscribe if you are new so you don't miss out on future updates keep in mind this is not financial advice and this video is only for entertainment purposes